Hey, what is up guys? At Jason Thiss back with a brand new video. Today I'm going to be talking about the Air Jordan Retro 4's what the or what the resale value. So I'm going to be showing you on my MacBook over here um, how much they're going for. So right now the Jordan Retro 4's are I believe like let me go on sneakers app. They are going for like two hundred dollars for retail. It'll probably come out to be two ten, uh, with the shipping included. So we have a, a lot of new releases, like the Air Jordan ones, high black reds, new Air Forces. But I mean, we're just here for the Air Jordan Four retros. What the? If they're actually worth reselling or not? Um, and we'll get more in depth later in the video. So here they are, the What the Air Jordan Four retros. They are. $200 they come out this Saturday at 9 in the morning um, What I've heard a lot is that a lot of stores are gonna be getting these So check on your local stores call them up be like hey you guys getting these new what the Air Jordan 4 retro is getting any new shipments of shoes For the majority part they should be getting them um, I was looking through the apps on Foot Locker and Foot Action and Champs I believe and on like one of those apps i found that they are doing a first come first serve in one of the malls i have nearby um so yeah check check on the applications um but the what the air jordan 4 is they look they look okay i mean i don't really see anything so vibrant something that pops off i mean not like the what the la's or the new york city air forces those are like those are like, what the heck are these? These are just like, they're just meh. I mean, they're, they're Air Jordan 4s. I mean, I feel like there's nothing insane about these. Um, but let's go check on StockX how much they're reselling for right now for some pre-release pairs. Um, I have to search these up, actually. What the Air Jordan? Here we go. So the Jordan 4 Retros, what the, they are going for, the highest bid is 250 for a size 14. You guys always want to look at the sizes because it's not how much you're going to sell your shoe for, um, depending on your size. And let's go, let's see if you, you cop an eight, a size 8. The, the resale price is $220, which you're really only making ten dollars off your pair because retail is going to cost 210 because nike always um charges ten dollars for the shipping so you're only going to be getting like 10 bucks and these aren't doing any well on stock x let's say you get a size 10 227 size 12 220 size 12 and a half 189 like here you're gonna be losing money if you go all out um but if you do want to cop multiple pairs let's say you cop 20 uh jordan 4 retros and you resell them for 220 or let's say 230 we get really lucky you could start making some profit you know that's going to accumulate even though you're making let's say 20 dollars or 10 bucks per pair it's going to accumulate you sell 10 pairs you just made a hundred dollars easily um but here's the analysis. I don't think you should go for these Air Jordan 4s because there's no resale value for them. But what you should do is cop them. If, cop them if you want them as a personal pair. Like, go for it. Like, you know, always cop if you want them as a personal. Don't let anybody stop you saying, nah, bro, they won't resell. Just, just buy them. If you like them, go ahead and buy them. But if you're looking to resell, I think you just skip on these. Um, there's more shoes that are coming out. And like the ones I mentioned early in the video, like the new, um, where are they? The new Air Jordan 1 Black and Reds and the Paranoid Air Force 1s. So back to what I was saying. Uh, I was on Discord earlier and this guy really got to my attention. He said something really smart. So he said... What I do when I'm not sure if these shoes are gonna flop or not, I always cop a pair that is my size. 
So if they flop, you still have something to wear. You feel me? Like, let's say I'm a size eight, so I'm a cop a size eight. And if it flops terribly, like the shoe is just, it just doesn't resell at all. I mean, like at least I have a pair of shoes and you can always return the shoes too. Like if they don't sell, you could just return them to Nike. You'll get your money back. And I think you, you do lose on the shipping. So you end up losing some money depending on how many pairs you buy. But I mean, that's kind of how the game goes. But other than that, if you really want to resell these, just pass on them. If you want them as a personal cop and you truly like them, go for them, man. It's $200. I mean, it's pretty expensive, but, you know, you go for it. Check on foot apps. Check on local uh, markets around you, malls, you know, stores, because I'm pretty sure they're going to be having these all over the United States. Um, so, yeah. If you guys didn't enjoy this video, um, don't forget to leave a like and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next episode if I do one. Yeah.